As we get older, many of us will experience a gradual rise in blood pressure. This is known as essential hypertension. And by calling it essential hypertension, we're saying it, we don't know what causes it. And the default position, the uncritical position, shared by many medical colleagues is that it just happens as you get older. What it does if you live in the West and live a Western lifestyle. But we know very well that it doesn't in many other parts of the world. So it's not an aging per se, it's an artifact due to living the wrong way. If you eat a Western diet which is full of inflammatory compounds and not enough of the anti-inflammatory compounds, you develop endothelial dysfunction, which you can regard as a kind of a low-level grumbling subclinic inflammation of the arteries. Get this condition right and get your sodium, potassium, magnesium balance right and your blood pressure doesn't go up. It's as simple as that. Uh, and of course, at a stroke, you've demolished half of the earnings of the drug industries, which is, in my view, not a bad thing. The Karelia experiment shows us quite conclusively that uh, by changing the salt that you eat from ordinary sodium table salt to a magnesium potassium compound, uh, pan salt, developed uh, by Heike Karpanen at the University of Helsinki, dramatically effective in reducing hypertension. And then add on to that omega-3 fatty acids, flavonoids, and all the appropriate dietary anti-inflammatory compounds, your blood vessels can last. Ah, relax, and as they do, this essential hypertension, in the majority of cases, disappears.